What's up everyone, today we're diving into the best OBS audio filter settings to help you achieve that crystal clear professional quality sound. Let's dive into it. To add audio filters in OBS, first head to the audio mixer panel. You'll see all your audio sources listed, like your microphone, desktop audio, etc. You're gonna find your microphone source, click the little gear icon next to it, and select filters. Now let's talk about the must-have audio filters for improving your sound. First up, noise suppression. This filter helps remove unwanted background noise like keyboard typing, air conditioning, or distant chatter. So choose noise suppression and set it to RN noise. It uses advanced AI to reduce noise without impacting your voice quality. You can adjust the suppression level, but I recommend starting it with the default settings and tweaking it if necessary. The goal here is to remove that background noise without making your voice sound too hollow. Up next is gain. This filter is perfect if your microphone is a bit too quiet. It boosts your input signal without changing the overall sound quality. I would start with a value of around plus 5 decibels. From here, you can fine tune it to match your needs. Keep in mind, adding too much gain can cause distortion, so adjust carefully. Now let's talk about adding noise gate. This filter cuts off any audio below a certain threshold, which is especially useful for eliminating background noise when you're not speaking. Set your closed threshold to around negative 40 dB and your open threshold to around negative 30 dB. These are good starting points, but feel free to tweak them based on your microphone and environment. Last but not least, let's add a compressor. The compressor helps out even out the volume level of your voice. So loud noises don't peak and quiet noises sound more audible. For the threshold, aim for about negative 18 dB and make sure the attack is set to 6 ms and release to 100 ms. These settings will help maintain a balanced and smooth audio experience. Now that we have our basic filter set up, let's talk about a couple of advanced tips to make your audio sound as best as possible. First off, microphone placement. Your microphone position is just as important as these settings. I recommend getting some type of mic arm to get it off of your desk. Also, be sure to keep it a few inches away from your mouth to avoid distortion and popping sounds. Finally, if you're in a room with a lot of echoes, I recommend adding some soft materials like pillows or blankets around your space to reduce reverb. Once you applied those filters and you did those advanced tips, make sure to do a quick test stream or recording to ensure everything sounds perfect. Remember, every setup is different, so feel free to tweak these settings to fit your voice and environment. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe down below, and ring the bell for more tips and tricks. If you have any questions, be sure to drop them in the comments. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have a good one. Peace out.